Hey folks, welcome back to Forever Skies. I'm just kind of sitting here listening. The ship is creaking like an old wooden sailing ship down in the hold. All the creaks and groans. Wow. Anyway, this is the, uh, the structure we were approaching at the end of last episode. I think it said the command center. Man, we're being pummeled by something. Whoa, no more forward. No more forward. <laughs> okay, let's drop in over here. Let's see what we've got. We seem to be leaning to the to the right a little bit. I mean, it's just my imagination. Set you down right there. Hop out, and what have I got on me? Nothing. Okay, so I think we're ready to go and scavenge this place. Anything out here? We've got lots of copper down there, and presumably an understructure. What's over here? Same thing, so it's just a matter of which way we want to get down. This one looks like not as far of a jump. Yeah, I like it. Alright, so pop in over here. Oh, yeah, okay. Well, let's not do that. <laughs> now, have we been to the command center before? I'm trying to remember. I seem to remember not wanting to take that jump last time. Guess I'll find out here when I get inside. Take you down. Whoa. Let's not go that way. Wow. That was close. Alright, around like so in here. Nope. We have not been in this particular one. I know there's multiple buildings out there with the same... Yeah, the same, uh, let me turn my volume down a little bit, uh, layouts and floor plans. So, you can definitely hit more than one and say, hey, haven't I been here before? Alright, so that kind of cleans this area up. we got copper to clean up above, and we need to get down there somehow. And the way that it wants you to do that is let's see here not that way I can't get around this way right yeah they want you to get down there or is it actually down here it's actually down here yeah let me back up a little bit I want you to go in right there though it's really hard to get there and wow that rain is loud turn my volume down a little bit Otherwise, we'll get it from the microphone and from the game. But let's take the ship down there if we can. And go in that way. Oh, we got the rocking going on. Yep, got these, uh, these air waves. <laughs> Boom. Okay, back up. Now, we need to get down into... Oh, that's close. Where am I at, it actually? I need to pull... Yeah, we have a blade underneath us. Okay. Let's... Hmm. Let's just back straight out for a while. And pull in this way. And then come back. Okay. Something like that. Now, we need to get down to that lower deck down there. Right in front of us. I don't know that it's possible, but I do know that the balloon's not sticking out so far that it can't be done. Just a matter of what we're going to hit over here. So far it's looking good. I'll grab all that dirty water and let's swing up a little bit. Okay, down just a touch, in a little further. Where do we first touch? Okay, I want to swing out. I think we're touching over here now. Can I go sideways? I can. All right, let's go try something. A little bit more and a little touch down. Okay, building tool. Let's build some catwalk out there and call that good. Or am I too close for that? What? Oh, I need metals. Yeah, I gotta back up about 
Oh, about a foot and a half. About 18 inches back. Let's go. <laughs> All right, there. Okay, grab some materials. Yeah, a stack of each. Got any small stacks? No, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's still the same number of places in my inventory. Pop you open. And build another catwalk or... What did I miss? Okay, let's grab metals from here. What did I miss? There's 36? Hmm. Did I not grab a stack of metals? In my mind, I did. Um, there, catwalk. One of you. And can I go a little further? I cannot. Too far from the airship. So that's as far as it goes. Okay. So let's bring you in a little bit further. Uh, touch over. Touch down. And a touch in. I think we're there. There we go. Duck down in and yeah, there's there's smarter ways to do that. Alright, what do we get? Sun and dark bee paint patterns. Okay. Duck down. You're there. And let's drop into here. And nothing there. Nothing else on the ground. Carefully. There we go. And there it is. Oh, wrong button. There is the, f I assume, freezer. Not refrigerator. Wrecked freezer. Okay. So put you away. Now we can make that. One of you. Anything else sitting around? Above? No. How about you? Nope. I'll take you, though. Nothing inside there. You guys are empty. Okay. Well, that was a great discovery. Now we can make our food last quite a bit longer. You drop it in and the timer really slows down. Alright. Didn't miss anything in here? Don't think so. So we need to grab the copper and then any of the glass and metals that we can find uh, along the structure. So, what can I do from right here? Probably nothing, huh? No, pretty much everything's buried except right there. Okay, nothing up in there. Ooh, I can get some of this. Well, I can get two of them. There we go, a little bit more. Ah, the ship is messing with me. Yeah, I'll have to wait. Alright, from here I can get a few, and then we'll ease out of here and get the rest. On the ceiling. Nope, didn't like that. Try that again. Yeah, the ship's moving up and down. <laughs> if I can hold it in the same spot, and there it goes. All right, same problem here, probably. There's glass out there. Okay. Yeah, let's see if I can get to this one. No, same problem. Ship's bouncing up and down. Gotcha. All right. Got a storm or something coming in. Let's get a little higher. Pull out, up. I gotta remember I got that little nose out there. Pull back a little further. I think I went too high. So what do I need to go? Let's oh, we've got junk stream out here. Let's pull this way. What keeps hitting us? It's from this direction. Hmm, that back corner may have taken some damage. But let's clean the rest of this stuff up. All I see in there, you and you, don't like that one, huh? There, right at the edge. Nope, that was the other one. There it goes. Something else in there. Guess I gotta get that from the other side. 
Okay, up in here. Right there. Okay. Right there. Nope. Alright, so swing around and grab that one. I guess this did not turn into a storm after all. Can I? Let's back up a little. Let's go higher. Get above that junk stream. Hydration. Where am I? There you are. In fact, can I get anything from here? Well, from here, that's all that I can see blinking. Let's go around one more time and then figure out where we're heading next. Look at the mountains out there. Okay. Where, what do we have now? Oh, boy, there's still quite a few more. I think I see a copper hiding in there. Yeah, that's a long shot. Nope, not happening. <clears throat> no more copper out there, over there. I think we're going to call this one done. <clears throat> Let's... What do we have food-wise anymore? Been a while since I've played this one. Had trouble last time. Oh, we had a bunch of coffee. Oh, there's food. Um, sure. Let's grab you two days left on you, but let's finish you off. And then we've got these guys to not need to ever sleep again. <laughs> I remember that. Now, I've had a, had trouble recording this game and Stranded Alien Dawn. Had, uh, I, I would record for an hour and then get to the end and it would not remux into i got another question mark there. Into an MP4 for me. So, and then randomly later, I don't know what I had done, but then it started to work. But it wouldn't let me put it into the editor or do anything with it. <clears throat> so that's why it's been a couple days between uh, episodes lately. So I, I finally got the last video of this series working and got it up and going and recorded Stranded Alien Dawn and it wouldn't. Turn a convert from an MKV to an MP4 for me, so I couldn't run it through my editor. Well, I downloaded the latest version of OBS, which is always a good and bad thing. You know, they they whoa, they tend to change things in between versions, and I'm trying not to get the whole corner of my ship smashed by one of those. <clears throat> and so I spent an hour going through YouTube videos trying to figure out how to run the new settings on the newest version of OBS. The NVIDIA settings changed quite a bit. But, um... Okay, so you're different. We're a communications hub. I'm waiting to see what she <clears throat> pops up here. So we need to go and find a wrecked shelf hanger. Oh! There's my... my my cabinets, my wall cabinets. Cool. So, where are they hiding and when's the lightning going to start? But, long story short, after all of that, and I was, you know, just getting ready to start testing OBS to see if it still worked and record a test video when I realized there was an option in there for called Remux that lets you manually convert a video from MKV to mp4 simple table okay and I out of curiosity I grabbed that file that I knew wasn't gonna work and threw it in there and it worked no it didn't it gave me a message that it didn't give me any other time before it said no memory no room on the hard drive and that's when I realized my hard drive was at zero percent left so apparently each time that it didn't work it's because it ran out of room and then when it did work, it's because I did something that deleted a file somewhere and made just barely enough room for it to ra seemingly randomly work again. Never really given me a clue as to why it was working again. Oh, it was a frustrating few days. 
So, deleted a bunch of of uh, files and got that going again. Can I jump? I can jump to there. Okay, that's the one that I was in. Yeah. So, I now have more room on my hard drive and everything's working good again. Okay, so we're done with up here. And I've got much higher quality video settings on OBS, so I'd be curious. Although I can't really test it with this video because I've decided for this series I'm not running a face cam, but usually the face cam in Stranded Alien Dawn, if you look at my face as I'm spinning the camera around, it will kind of tear an artifact all over the place in there. It doesn't like the two videos on top of each other. So um, I tested it with these new settings and it seemed to work perfectly. So I think we actually have a better quality videos now with the new uh, OBS version. So we'll get the next video made in Stranded Alien Dawn and we'll see, uh, see how that works. And I'm just kind of mindlessly collecting here while I'm talking because I have a hard time doing two things at once. <laughs> um, <clears throat> okay, so everything here looks done. No wall cabinets laying around so far. Um, search for all the plastic we can find. Any sun melons? Ooh, got one. Okay, make another lure out of that. They actually make pretty good food, too. I think you get water and food out of it. As long as you cook it. You'll get the photo virus. Photophobia? I think that's what it is. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> nothing up above. Boy, lots of goodies. Out of inventory. We'll skip the patch. That's fine. So... I think I've been there. I think I've been there. So what's left in the structure? I haven't seen. Grab you guys till we run out of space. Good. <clears throat> the roof. There's a path up to the roof, so that might mean something. Yeah, or it means I'm going to fall to my doom here. Uh. <laughs> Nothing up there. All right, so that wasn't anything. Jump over. We've been here. Around. How do we get back up? <clears throat> and I'm certain it's not that one. Got to be a staircase here I'm not seeing. Unless that staircase is called a, uh, a tree trunk. Yep, I think so. So back up over here. So, have we been to this one? Possibly not. But, let's unload while we're here. And water. Water, bad. Alright, drink, drink. Let's restock you, you, and you. Okay, so food is food. Fine enough. Okay, all right, let's get rid of these. <clears throat> those and those. And plastic, glass, and copper. And don't have room to eat that one. Don't have room to eat that one on the bars there. Water, I could get rid of that one. That's 25. I'll wait on that one as well. Uh, sun melon. Let's go ahead and get that going. Boy. I want to say plastic and copper? <clears throat> Been a while. Food? That's not food. Yep, plastic and copper. Perfect. Drop you off and you off. Printing completed. And drop... Uh, well, I know there's room here, so we'll just toss you in there. Don't really need that. And fuel... Ah, uh, boy. There? That's where you guys are going. Okay. Alright, back out there again. Now. Was it that one? That door's been opened. Must have been over here. <clears throat> Ooh. I didn't see that at all. 
Here you are. The one stray piece that doesn't fit. <laughs> you think if you mounted to a wall somewhere. No, a storm's not coming. I'm not ready for a storm yet. Okay, going down to this one. Alright, let's get this done. What was that? It said first aid kit. It was yellow. Hmm. Alright, nothing unusual out of any of these. Just the normal stuff. Alright. Now the lightning's gonna get close. Is there a door or do I need to tear a wall out? Ah, got a door. Ah, membrane? First aid kit. Okay, got those. Anything on the walls? Wow. No. Alright. Oh, there's one more. Couple more of you. Alright, what'd I miss? I do not want the lantern. Or not. Well. I guess that could be an interesting decoration. Okay. Now, I've noticed in this game that lightning comes in groups of four. As I go through to edit, I'll take the volume down on the environment sounds, the game sounds, when the lightning storm hits. And I've noticed that there's four loud bursts in the, in the uh, audio line. And then a pause, then four, and then a pause, then four, and a pause. So... Wait a second here. I know when lightning's gonna hit. I think that's number three. Oh, there's four. I think I'm free to roam around now. There's another melon. I've got a few seconds before I have to... Where's that ladder up? Um, I guess I'm looking for a branch or a, a trunk. No, ladder up. There you are. Okay, about time for that last round of lightning to hit. Better get back on that ship. I did get the battery. I think I did. Okay, close these. Write everything down. There. Doesn't mean we're not going to get hit, but it's going to be a lot quieter. Okay, we can make one more lure. Yeah, we got plenty of lures. Let's go ahead and cook this one. Now, did the storm officially end, or are we really isolated that well from the sound? I'm not sure. There's another round of... of thunder coming or not. On. On. Yeah, I think it's over. Alright. Let's grab you and toss you in. And water now. I've got ten of them on me. Good. I like these large bottles. Yeah, that really helps a lot. So, let's what? I don't really need to get rid of a can now. I guess... Didn't I have a... There you are, food ration. Um, yeah, I guess we'll just do that. And same thing with the water. Yeah, we'll clear that out. And we still don't need 25 energy, so we'll wait on, on the, the coffee bean. You are... 20 and 20, and health. So, those are good. Good stuff there. Um, let's grab one of these so I can get rid of that membrane. You and you. Perfect. Okay, what next? We can clear all the uh, materials out of this area. Let's see what I can get from here. And these guys are going to 
max out all the other... In fact, I could make use of them. Sure. Up. Back. And you guys clear these out for me. Perfect. Okay, a little bit further in. Can you shoot through there? Through the middle, guys. Come on. Okay. There's a little more. Alright, let's come around this side. Alright, now what can you do? Nothing. <laughs> okay. Well, let's um, head up and around to the other side, then we'll figure things out. What about those levels where the junk stream seems to attack us? Alright, swinging around here. Pivot. And uh, back a little and drop. How far can I drop? There I am. Guess that is it. Uh, not that one. That one. Alright, we'll try one more side. Right in there. I don't remember going up. I got the battery, so I guess I did. Hmm. How far down dare I go? Hello. I guess we're about to make contact here. Right there. Did I really hit five structures? I just remember there's one up in here. I'm going to peek one more time. I know I dropped down and got two, then I dropped down and got two. So I guess I did go up and get one. Okay. And I think I can drop safely there. All right. Well, we've already had our storms. We can sit around for a while. So let's grab some stacks here. I could use... Oh, grab the metals and the synthetics. And same thing there. You guys have fun just kind of cleaning up out there. In fact, let's back up a little, swing around, and give you the junk stream. There. You guys have a ball. All right. Research. What did we just find? Right there. They call it a hanging shelf. Which is a little misleading. It's got doors, so that means a cabinet. And I need plastic. And pretty soon I won't have boxes sitting on the floor. That's going to be nice. Alright. Hanging shelf. That. This guy. Patterns. Furniture. Basic chair. We just found... A simple table. Just found that one. Okay. Hanging shelf requires fabricator. Freezer. Oh, I need polymer and helium. Helium's here. Polymer is way back over here. Only two left. Alright, remind me. Polymer is epoxy? I'm out of room anyway. Okay. I think I needed two to do the research, so... Yeah, I need one. Okay, that one going. So polymer production. Polymer is plant oil and synthetics. Okay, plant oil. We'll get rid of the little guy first. Don't have any room. All right. So what can I get rid of? Uh, miscellaneous box. Well, I've got those all over the place now, but there. There, I guess you take that one, and nothing over there. And then up here, get, no, we're full. So 
So we'll dump all of these guys in there. Okay. So I need epoxy. Now I dumped epoxy somewhere. Ah, that's where the uh, where the lantern should have been. Where did I dump epoxies just to get by one time? There they are. Grab those. We have synthetics. Let's make uh, just a bunch of polymer just to have some around. I grabbed the wrong thing, didn't I? Oh, I was full. That's why I never got the plant oil. Okay. You. And that's enough to make four. We'll do that for now. Right? One each? Yeah. One of you. And right there. Okay. Okay. So everything is good here. We have just helium fuel left. Cartridges. Balloon core. And filtering bottles. Okay. So when these two are done, let's take a look at what we need to build those other two Printing things. Completed. Right there. So we just created storage. Freezer is storage. Hanging shelf is storage. Hanging shelf needs plastic, metal, and synthetics. Freezer needs polymer, helium, and transformers. Ah... Well, let's go for transformers. And I can make two of them. Right there. Okay. Something's decreasing. Two of you. And that will do for now. Though I will grab... Oh, are these going bad now? Man. Okay, now I'm going to have to actually sleep. Bummer. Okay. Yep, yeah, needed that freezer, huh? All right, so storage, freezer, needs helium. Right there. And let's put some things away. This is the box that I'm putting things like this. Um, you can drop down there. And toss you in there. Okay. So let's make a shelf and a shelf. Get those going first. They're going to sit in this area. I think I can get four on that wall. Which means this has to go away as soon as I do that. Okay. Then we'll get the freezers going, which set where? Printing completed. Hmm. Printing completed. Okay, well, two things at a time here. You guys. So, four. Hmm. I want them on this wall as well. So I don't know how they're going to interact in the corner. So I guess I want to start here. Can I go to the floor? I can. So you're there. Five. Back up a bit so I can see. The ship is swinging up and down, so I'm swinging up and down. See that? And we are being impacted hard. Let's have another storm going on. Okay, let's... Yeah. Where am I? I'm kind of in a rough area. Boy, look at the damage. Guys, no, no, no. Let's get away from this structure. something down there too okay where can I go it is not on top of something what is was well, a lot of sound a lot of damage further forward and there's a structure there what is going on out here there's so much down here Okay, a little further forward. And I can drop and get out of this, and I don't have to worry about what's happening around me. Okay. I think I'm good now. Drop and get out of here. Junk streams have gotten more dangerous. Oops, too low. Boy, you get down too low, and... The ship automatically closes all of your doors on you and seals you in. Like you're getting down into the toxic levels. Kind of cool. But let's grab ten of these because I just 
broke the ship like all over the place. Why can't I get around that? Okay, four. There it is. Okay, there's all that. Yep, you took it too. That's why you collect vast amounts of repair kits. You don't think you're ever going to need it, then all of a sudden, wow, you need it. Alright, there was a lot more noise going on than just that. It seemed like it was back here somewhere. Ah, damage that. Anything up in here? Could be. Okay, you're fine. You took some damage. Crawl underneath. Nope, you're okay. There. Alright, I think we're okay now. Whew! Where was I? I was building. These two are done. Let's talk about freezers now. One of you gonna need another polymer. Um, I'll get you going. Over here, give me a polymer. I want two freezers at least. And that's going to be a while, huh? You are upgrades. I do want to upgrade all of these at some point. But not necessarily right now. Come on, Mr. Polymer. There you go. And storage, and you. Perfect. Alright, get you guys going. Um... Nothing sitting in here? Nope. Alright, so... How to lay out all of this. I'd like to, if, I, if it'll let me, I'd like to get eight cabinets in there. So I'm hesitating how to do the corner. I think I these guys have to go in, and this one stretches out further. Okay, freezer... You guys away, toss you down there. Four. Alright, so that's a freezer. What I'm curious about, uh, four, is toss you and pick you up. That didn't work. Q. There we go. Freezer is four. If I were to set you like so, can I put five on top of you? I can. That's kind of interesting. Compact little space. Cook it, freeze it, drink it. I like it. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's pull this guy up as well, if I can. Yeah, I'd have just enough room. Okay. Four down here. Like so. Yeah, that'll work. And I may realign these guys a little bit later. Over there. Like that. And like so. Alright, toss water back into you. And top you off. And then... There you are. Top you off. And I can still get up here. Clean water bottle or bottle clean water. Yep, it's all there. Frieza gives you nine spaces. And you, 17 hours left. Actually, I could use you right now. So we'll do that. So here was the long, or the, the, the game plan for the kitchen. Two of these guys, they go down. Wait for them to come back. Let's think about cabinets. So you guys needed actually just more metals and synthetics. Okay, here they come back. Metals, metals, synthetics, synthetics. Oh, this is not going to work. Okay, so let's get rid of at least two spaces. There we go. So grab you guys. 
toss you in here. What, you're the glowing dust moth. And you are a fat dust moth. Good stuff there. Those guys cook. Could send two more down. That's when you start getting a kitchen that's working efficiently. Now, did I actually load up materials? I did enough. Alright, cabinet. Cabinet. Dust moths. And lost a lure. And grab one of those. So I almost need four stoves, or cookers. It takes about twice as long to cook as to fish. But, that'll be fine. Alright, so you guys, boom boom, and you're going in here. And what is that, four? I hate that I can't see when I'm that close. I have to back up. So, I'll wait for the ship to swing. There, nope, moved. Yeah, one more time. Let's get that straight. Uh, cute. That'll work. Okay. And let's get two more going. Grab you guys and load another one in. And we can toss these guys in here. So I've got 2 hours, 23 minutes, and 45 seconds. 2 hours, 23, 45. 44. So it, it cuts the time down considerably, the, the countdown. 43. Whereas over here, 41, 40, it, it pretty much goes 1 per second. So kind of real time there. So toss you in here, you can see it really slows it down. It's still going down, but it's going to give you a lot more time. I don't know what the, the number is. Seems like it lasts about five times as long, but... Okay, grab you guys, and I'll stop there for now. More cabinets. And... So I can get to about there. So let's get you unloaded, which is going to be difficult. What was that? Cookers. Let's get those going first so I can get two, sp two things out of my inventory. There we go. And look at the cloudiness coming through. All the light changes. Alright, um, you. Almost. Temporarily we'll just toss you in there. Oops, wrong way. Okay. You get picked up. And five. Right there. Perfect. Two more? Uh, maybe. No, I need plastic. Here. Grab you. And a synthetic. Boy, two fabricators is nice. You guys are almost done. Waters. Yep, this is a that's a good combination there. I can almost block this off right here and call that a kitchen and be, be satisfied. You two. I got you both? No. There we go. Toss you guys in. I won't need food for a while. Uh, what is what? 75 food and 55 food. So some of these foods get so high so 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 much food value per that you almost can't uh, you have to wait till you're starving to death to make full use of it so you guys and let's do you one more time there and there for the kitchen so you're gonna go here so I doesn't want to go even interesting why is that Well, you're just going to be up in the air a little bit. Okay. Printing completed. Printing completed. All right, something like that. So I'm thinking this top guy is going to be metals, and this guy is going to be synthetics. 
and gradually as we get more and more batteries and our two sentries out front there continue to bring them in we will have plenty to load into here so I'd say stick to the idea of the electronic parts for now in just one cabinet um, yeah that should be enough for there the occasional transformer or transistor whatever they're calling it in the motherboard but we rarely have those um, and then the materials are down here and we just don't see that many of them yet so plastics there coppers there glass there eventually this will fill up and we'll need to use more of these but for the moment let's see out over here let's get into things like epoxies and what we make epoxies from that makes sense is that here yeah there and there and it's going to take quite a while to fill that up resins what did the resins make they make epoxy so resins make epoxy and these guys make the other one the polymers so they're kind of all related um tell you what let's do that 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 put you in there okay what no <laughs> do that again there i see what i did and something just hit my ship there we go okay so that is that whole group and there's yellow in there there is yellow in there um 20 okay fine we'll go make another epoxy or another uh, polymer um need to get this guy out of there so i can do that and polymer right there okay uh, could use a food so let's grab one of the 55s wait for a little bit there so what else I was I've done that I've done that so let's cue these guys so I'm not stepping over them oh that feels so much better look at that yeah okay so I'm not sure where best but for the moment this bottom corner can just be... Nope, we did find something for there. Here? Yeah. Down in there will be just some random stuff for the moment. I guess including bottles until I convert those over to large bottles. Sure. So I do need another... Make another large bottle. Which was polymers. Hmm. Okay, so you're done. Yeah, large bottles. Uh, do that. That. There we go. QU. And do I have room? I might. Okay. And Q. Great. So down in here. Alright. So miscellaneous containers. We'll go with that. These guys are more of... Oh, scientific. They're, they kind of go with... Where is that thing? Over here? Yeah. So they kind of do this. Let's... Let's kitchen cabinet over here just to get these guys used. Like so. And this time I think I won't do the floor. Right, let's take you out to about like that. And Q... Five, four, four. Oh, we're not consistent. Yeah, I see that it does that sometimes. Alright, that'll work. We could put a table right here. But for now, let's transfer. Got room? I don't have room. Okay. So let's make more. Uh, what are you? Polymer. Okay. Do I have... I don't. So I need metals and plastics. I guess I put everything away. Ah, uh, boy, I remember now. You're... Why didn't I go there with you? I think I meant to. I did. They were supposed to be underneath each other. Yeah. A storm is coming. Okay, crap. Just swap around a little bit. Yeah, this is fun. 
Uh, you. Glass. Okay. Um, here. You're supposed to be this kind of stuff. So in that case, you guys went there, there, there. That's what I wanted. So you, and one of you, and one of you, and let's make a couple more of those. Whoa, ship was damaged. Okay, well there's confirmation that you can be hit, even clear down at this level, off by yourself. Okay, let's swing you around. First of all, let's close that. We're closed. Nope. We'll seal up. Let's swing you around. See if we can find that last structure. Down here where you can't see a thing. There's something. Ah, we got debris in the way. Let's go through here. Kind of like navigating a submarine. Huh? Through a channel. Trying not to hit. Oh, wow. I think the game just got a little real as far as damage goes. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to eat up before it takes my own health away. There we go. And I guess we could test the theory. Wonder if it will let your ship be damaged while you're sleeping. Waiting for messages right here. Make sure my health is up far enough that if I take a direct lightning hit, I'll have enough health left to maybe survive it. Okay. Did that finish off the storm? Wow, that was, that was something else. All right, let's grab, I guess, two stacks of you. Yeah, I think the lightning's done. Okay, well that did a pretty good job, but there was another lightning hit before. Let's see, there's one more... Yeah, there was another spot over there, but seems like we were hit twice. One I ignored. Uh, uh, right in here. How we took it down there, I don't know. Five, four. So there's a little tiny bit left there. Nothing above. Okay. All right, well. Let's go up. Storm's over. Let's go high and let's go where? I don't see any... Let's go to... Well, these are too far away, the greenhouses. I don't see a lily pad complex. None of those shapes are in there. We got mountains to behind us. We apparently have come from the would be the northeast up there. You see that that little blue triangle with with the uh, the platform grayed out. So we came from that direction. Oh, there's up there. There's a greenhouse. Uh, top left. Okay. Spin around. Let's go that direction. Is that that one? No. Ah, oh, it's over here. Okay. So go here, and at the very least, we'll park underneath that structure. So if we get another lightning storm, it should take the damage for us. So we'll go that route. Um, both of our sentries have batteries, but they're not shooting because they only have tanks available for glass. You see the, the blue in the bottom line right there. It must be a touch of blue in there as well. Fuel is decent. So we'll head over here. I think I can get down lower. No 
we'll just park this thing and then continue our interior remodeling. That's what we're doing. Though we're getting into the junk stream here. Let's go above this and drop down at the last minute. Junk stream seems to do quite a bit of damage nowadays. Now the last greenhouse I'm sure we took the battery out of, so this can't be it. So that means a whole new uh, selection of glass up there. In fact, we could do that while there's no storm. Let's do that. How far up can I go? Yeah, they only have tanks available for glass. So let's just let them have a ball in there. Okay. Got a little uh, laggy in there. All right, so I was doing what before <laughs> all hell broke loose? I was going to move this guy. All right, so Q, U, and five. Yeah, everything's laggy right now. Five, there we are. And rotate. There we are. So put you in there. Wow, really laggy. Tell you what, I'm going to shut down and restart, see if we can get the system working better. Hold on. All right. Yeah, that, that looks a lot better. Nice and smooth again. Okay, so we got you mounted there. Do I have the cabinets on me? No, right there. So that is a five. We can put those sorts of things that belong to this guy right there, right? Yeah, kind of. Let's move you out just a little bit. Just make it look a little better. We have room over here. Actually, would you be better right there? You just might. Yeah, I like that better. Alright, you need to leave. What is the bedroom? Is it the whole back end? I don't know. Haven't thought that far ahead. Um, for right now... Where do I want to sleep? Yeah, I'll sleep over here with a view. Yeah. Yep, I like it. Okay, so you are all of... I got you on me already, okay. Though I don't think the frost crystal should be here. Hmm, there. Didn't I have another specimen of some kind frost crystals seems like they should well one stack over here let's go that route and eventually long term there would be other things to put in these cabinets i walk right past it but over here somewhere hmm so you are storage you are unknown you are the only one that's certain right now so let's make batteries out of you let's grab just one of you as a placeholder and one of, yeah, I guess both of you can go there. So stack of crystals in there. Crystals and batteries and something else. I'm not sure what. Only needed with one cabinet there. We've got two cabinets in the kitchen. And where else to put a cabinet? What do we do with this area? I say we spread this out a little bit. This looks kind of odd. So you can live there. And let's pick you up and pick you up so research if research does this that's if hmm that other one we could do something different like pop a wall in here uh, gl glass hydration again glass would be here That feels a little cramped. I was going to say we could put something out here. Still have it kind of belonging to that area. Okay, so if we didn't do that, two and you and you, then we could just have you free float? I guess so. So, four, something like this, or this. Don't know. Because I'm thinking 
Well, yeah, if there's probably a good time to shut the episode down because I really don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I guess that's not too congested to get into there. Okay. Um, let's deal with this real quick. I got room now? Not really. Let's go and load some things. So we have another cabinet. This is where storage containers are going, so we'll do that. You are synthetics. You are metal. You are those things. You are these things. Like that. And polymers, we're kind of going in with all of this stuff, but it is a material. It does kind of make sense that it belongs here, too. I think I'll do that. Um, a lot of first aid stuff. That was kind of landing over here in foods. So, kitchen, I guess, is the closest thing we have to a, a, a med bay. Yeah. Okay, so over here, let's grab food and food like things. Alright, up in here. So, I guess lures are going to kind of take this area over. Oh, that was all of them. Okay. No lures in there. Do have one hiding in there. And you don't have any. Okay. So lures are there. Then we're going to grab all of these. And we're going to just eat that one because it doesn't fit. Alright, you are going to be waters. Anything to do with water. Alright, that's all of you. And one, two, three, four, five... And then I thought maybe just med bay, med med kits over here for now. This is more of a food thing, but I guess you're going to be right there. Okay, so these can go away. Right there, and you kind of go here, but I'm kind of running out of room. Yeah. I'll leave you in there and there for now. Actually, you can go there for now. All right, so I'm thinking some kind of a table. We'll call it a prep table. Just more for role play than anything. Am I in the right place? I am. So I need metal synthetics. Well, I don't know what I need. You're a casual table. You're a solid table. You're an office desk. You're a simple table. I'm kind of liking the simple table. Epoxy plastic synthetics. Plastic, epoxy, synthetics. Simple table. Watch this guy operate. Printing completed. Wow. I was expecting a little more drama than that. Okay, you are a four. So, height-wise, I guess you are about the same. Hmm. In a, another save, I had put the cookers on top of this guy, and it wouldn't let me put those up there at all. So, why it's letting me now, I don't know. Huh. Okay, so let's put you... I guess centered in this area would be good. Yeah, kind of a prep area and storage. I'm not sure what we'll do over here. Though this could be... Oh, where do we want to put the battery charger? It's not kitchen, but where it does seem to fit, it's really congested right now. It could be right here. Let's do that. Uh, Q. Yeah, what's a good height? It'll go all the way to the top, but it doesn't seem realistic. Yeah, something like that. So these can all start to go away, but... I could put another cabinet up for something like first aid or, I don't know, miscellaneous stuff that I'm just not sure of where to put anywhere. But yeah, I think first aid would feel better not with the, the drinks. Okay, you are fuels. Ah, so we do need a cabinet back here somewhere for all fuel related things, though we make the fuel here, which means it kind of fits here now. Hmm. So the fuel supplies 
the helium and the biomass need to be here somewhere. So I'm thinking you're in here. You guys and you guys there. So fuel themselves. They're going to be loaded up through here for if we have only two engines. I'm almost thinking about putting the... Well, it, it seems easier to get to the engines to refuel them when they're out the back end than going up this ladder. Maybe if I had a... Well, it won't let me mount it if there's a door right there. I could mount it if I put it up higher and then put a door right there. Huh... Well, we don't need to deal with that one right now, but that's something to be thinking about. And i got to figure you out. Pull out one row of cabinets and put you right back over here. That's possible. We do have some extra space in here. We could take some of these categories and move them around a corner or something. That hydration level. I kind of like that idea. You are kind of not much right now. And you, same. Okay, let's pull you off the wall. And pick you up. Alright, let's untangle that mess. Right there. So if I were to put five... Right here, or right here? I think I like it right here. And depth-wise, I can go as far as there. Let's bring it out to the right to there, so I got a little more space to stand in here. Okay, and one of those cabinets, four, could then go over here, but it won't necessarily be part of this guy. It'll be more of this guy. In fact, that could be the fuel for now. It probably could. All right, so you are more of a miscellaneous. It needs to go somewhere else. And you, for the moment, will just pick up all of this random stuff that we just dumped out of here and figure that out next episode. <laughs> there, that pile. Okay, so we have an extra hanging cabinet yet. But the fuels could go in here. Just to give them an official place. Okay. So these can all be cleaned up and picked up and put away somewhere. Um, let's go deal with that. Did I get all of them? Yeah. So do that. Let's grab just one, put you in there, and clip you. And one there and cook you. When I hit E, or yeah, I E to get out of this, it now grabs this. Hmm, I guess I have to learn, well, escape's a long reach. That's, yeah, I'm not sure. Anyway, I like it how these go up and down through their cooking process, like they're pressurizing. <laughs> All right, so food-wise, we're gonna be fine. Let's grab one of you and drink All right, two of you. So what do we do with, I, actually, I've made space, haven't I? Yeah, we used up a lot of these. Right there. And for the moment, I'll just set you there. Alright, miscellaneous. Where'd you go? Oh, you went down there. And drop you in there. Yeah, I've got to remember to decorate with some of those. So you are an overcooked meal. And you look horrible. But I'll take you for 15 food just to get you gone. And drop you in there. So normally I hit E to get in and out. See that? I put you in there and hit boil and hit E. Well, it, it worked this time. So I guess it depends on where I'm standing. See the, the E for open down there? I guess that was you know, on the screen when I hit E to get out of this. So it must have triggered down there. I don't know. Something. Anyway, that's fine. What else is in here? You're empty. You're empty. You are items that I wanted to be uh, tools and whatnot. Okay, that's an idea. So pull you back off and grab that last cabinet. 
put you up first, five, like that, and then put four right underneath, and off to the side. Give me a little more space in there. Okay, so things that get charged is kind of my thought. All of the, the tools, and I guess paint supplies are kind of landing here too, but we could put, I kind of lost you, there you are, paint, and the gun with its ammo, paint and its stuffs, and then other tools, whether it's that one or this one or what have you, kind of go in this area near the charger. So that's all making sense. So grab you, uh, Q, Q, and Q. And what is that, four? Yeah. So these all need to find homes. And I know I'm running out of room over there. So let's just do this for now. Another one of you. So we need to get more polymer, a large quantity of it, so we can convert more of these bottles into big bottles. And then we can relieve pressure out of this guy. Let's see. So I want to go here, drop you off, go here, drop you off. And I think with that, we'll call this one done. We'll hit the greenhouse next time, but I'm probably well over an hour now. Yeah, so little by little, the ship is get, getting built and getting furnished. And we're going to start seeing a, you know, a long term what this thing's going to look like. I'm still not sure what to do back here. A big open space is so hard to to conceptualize until you start putting dividers and walls in then it starts to make sense you know once you divide it up into into usable chunks so that looks good so this would make a good bedroom i think if not back here so right you know leave comments any thoughts or suggestions this guy doesn't need to be here so we need to put some of these up on the wall or on shelves we do have wall shelves available that we haven't even thought of using yet uh, storage racks for these boxes but I like these better so I'm not sure where to even put storage racks yeah, I, I like lining the walls and leaving the the floors available to walk around so I'm not sure what to do storage rack wise other than just doing one so we can see it see how it works but with that let's get this guy eaten before it overcooks my overcooked meal and uh, uh, how are we doing here still have two days and 17 hours and two days and 18 hours yeah a lot of time there good so with that let's call this one finished it's been a little rambler thanks for watching guys and i'll catch you next time bye bye now